All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching the Eminence and Shadow episode two. Um, this is another anime uh, that I was not expecting to watch this season. I kind of saw it and heard some good things about it, but I was still not expecting to watch it. However, I did check out episode one off, obviously, off channel. Um, and it was really freaking good, actually. Uh, seems like a really interesting take on the isekai uh, kind of stuff, not just boring, bland, old, crap isekai. Um, the main character seems very cool. He was uh, training himself all his life on some Naruto shit, dropping like wrist wrist weights or leg weights, whatever they were. Um, hella strong. He's almost military, self military trained, it would seem. Um, and yeah, and he just seems really cool. I can't believe he got taken out by truck gun, of all things. But you know, it's an isekai. Some tropes have just got to stick, I guess. <laughs> um, yeah, now he's in this other world, not the usual kind of Konosuba walled city kind of world looks very interesting uh, I think it kind of looks like um, old old London old London kind of uh, style so very cool um, and yeah now he's he's got his own mission in this world it seems honestly really really refreshing and interesting for an easy guy so I'm very much looking forward to it so as always guys if you're new to the channel please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well and let's go into this episode right now Does he look like a younger version of himself in the other world in this world, or does he look slightly different? I can't remember what he looks like. He's younger here, no? Like, when we saw in the first episode when he came to the other world, he looked older, I think. Yeah, he does look very similar to him in the other world. And he died at 18, okay. And then he's reborn in this world. God damn. Oh, and he's got his adult brain in there too. Lol. Bro, the reincarnated in another world mom's always a MILF. God damn it. Oh, he can recognize that? Wow. Just pumped out Dark Knights? Yeah! Always reborn into like a good family, aren't they? Oh, and the, the older sister kicks ass. Yeah! Background character A. Lol. Damn, he's a killer! What is with his cloak? It's like moving. Or like the pattern on it is anyway. What the hell is this magic? He can become a slime? Bro, you need someone to tell you where the valuables are. Is he made of slime? What is this? Slime bodysuit. Oh, so is that the thing that's moving on his, uh, his cloak? What is this, man? Like... Chaotic lawful or something. <laughs> what in the fuck is this? What the hell? <laughs> this character is so crazy. Bro, I love this chaotic ass MC. The blob became a waifu. Let's go. Oh, so that's what she was before. Give her some clothes, maybe? Bro really tried to look cool there. <laughs> Is he lying to her right now? He's like, oh, you had a curse on you. They, I mean, she was clearly fucked up, but... Or is he telling the truth? I have no idea. He keeps looking to, He keeps looking away. He has to be lying. He's gonna make up some bullshit. <laughs> His name from the other world. Shadow. That's an easy name to remember. 
How old is he supposed to be here? Like 12? I can't believe he's lied to this girl, man. <laughs> I mean, he did save her, which is fair. That's what we like to hear. <laughs> this guy. This guy is chaotic as fuck. Shadow Garden. Okay. I'd lived my way through my first performance. <laughs> oh, so what? He was only 10 years old then? Is he doing this on purpose so he doesn't have all uh, the kind of eyes on him in the family? Oh my god, he was just like flexing that he could have killed her there. Lol. Oh, she could feel something about the... His name's Sid. Like the... Like the guy from Ice Age. <laughs> this is hilarious. He's like dummy strong and he's just pretending that he's not. Oh shit, she gone missing? Did someone steal her? <laughs> the mom's pissed. <laughs> Bro, she's beating his ass. The women in this family are hella strong. Oh, we got someone else. Bro, he is securing the harem fast. Jeez. He got hella waifus. So has he lied to all these girls? Like, the the higher powers when in reality they're really just bandits? Bro, I'm getting Overlord vibes from this. This guy is like bullshitting his way through life like lines. <laughs> the Seven Shadows. That's dope. So was it? Like Alpha, Beta, Charlie, Delta, Echo, Foxtrot and whatnot. Damn, she doesn't give a fuck. Oh, so her brother taught her magic. She's kind of dumb. But I guess uh, Sid is just good at lying. Oh, she broke out of that easily. Oh, shit. Bro, this brother-sister duo are crazy. Oh, you're about to get fucked up. Yes, dude. It's gory as hell. I love it. Did th I thought his head just fell off. That was hilarious. Fuck. Bunch of 15-year-olds just fucking you up right now. He's like, what the fuck is the call of Diablos? <laughs> or no, is he actually with the call of Diablos? Damn, okay. Bro, we've time skipped a bunch to these girls being like, well, for one, there's like loads of them now, but also them just being hella strong. Oh, he's going berserker mode. Oh, he escaped. Damn. I like how they all have this slime bodysuits. Is this him? Oh, that was easy. The tip of his sword? God! Your lunge is weak. Bro, this boy is a demon. A lesson too. <laughs> Ooh, through the shoulder, across the chest. Are we about to get a backstory for this dude? Boy, if you don't get sliced in half. 
Oh no, we're actually getting a backstory for him. Fuck. Oh, he's overdosing right now. Bro, he probably didn't even use magic there. He is too strong. Rip. You're dead. No, at least you got to see your daughter for the last time. You're not going to leave that with his body? Or is he going to go find his daughter or something? I like how this boy is playing everyone. The position of main protagonist. <laughs> Oh, he's only 13 here. His sister's the one that turned 15. Okay. Eh? What? What? Where are you going? What? Alright, so that was the Eminence and Shadow episode 2. Um, yeah, Sid is a very interesting MC. <laughs> he started out his harem with, uh, well, lying to them, basically. Um, I don't know whether that lie is still being fulfilled or he's actually trying to take down this cult, I guess. Um, because the the guy, the bandit guy, seemed to know about the the, the kind of the Diab Diablos or whatever it was. Um, but I don't. But by the way, he was calling them bandits. I don't actually think they were anything to do with it. I might be wrong. I might be misreading this. Um, but yeah, <laughs> very good sec second episode. I definitely like the main character. He's definitely very powerful. He's more on the chaotic, evil kind of side, but he's still lawful in some way, um, which is pretty different. Um, I'm excited to see them, uh, obviously, more aged up, as well as um, seeing when they move into the main city, um, as we saw in the first episode, because I think that would be a much cooler setting to be in. But yeah, anyway guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did, and I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Have an interesting day, and peace out.